What's going on guys, Will here and today I'm back with another video. So today I'll be showing you guys a couple new pickups I got um, and they both have to do with batting so uh, let's get right into this. Alright so the first thing that I'll be showing you guys today is my new Nike Vapor batting gloves. So I got them in red, it looks kind of orange but uh, well they're said to be red and they seem to go good with all the red things I have. So they're red Nike Vapor with black uh, palm and trim and then uh, neon or volt green or yellow. So I still haven't used them in a game or to swing with just because we just got a lot of snow so I can't really use them. But I'll try them on for you guys and let you know how they feel. But before I do that I'll just show you guys uh, what the insides look like. So you have Vapor, the Nike Vapor logo on the inside and then Nothing special, you got a tag, and then they seem pretty breathable. So uh, yeah, I'll put them on now. So I've got them on now. So I got large, and they are pretty tight on me, but like they're snug. Very comfortable. I'm pretty sure they're this sheepskin on um, the palm. So that pre seems pretty good. And then you've got a little bit of breathing area on the palm there and between the thumb where it runs in. You also have a uh, Nike baseball logo on each of the wrists. Yeah, I've got a feeling... Like most batting gloves, they'll start to wear down once they start touching pine tar and things like that. But right now, they're flexible. All you really need them is to hold a bat, unless you're putting them under your batting glove, which I don't plan on doing. These are the batting gloves, and I think I'm going to keep them on to show you guys my bat. So the bat that I got is a custom model JC24 Maple Pro Reserve Wood. Um, it's a 32 and a half inch drop three, so that's 29.5 ounces. I got it with a black handle and a dark cherry barrel with a gold chrome logo outline. So just something on the JC24. It's like a 271. Unlike the 271, it has a thicker transition area in between the barrel and the handle and it you know it's it's thicker and the knob is a bit more flared than a 271 um i haven't taken any hits with it as you can tell as it's still very nice and shiny but um it seems really nice and i'm a really big fan of the handle and how it feels in my hand i'll be putting pine tar for sure i might be getting lizard skin depends how i like the feel of it without there's probably a good chance that i will but right now i really like the feel of it so um if you guys want to get evictus i would recommend either going through uh tpez underscore v sticks on instagram and getting a pro stock pro cut the the bats that are still good but they don't pass the major league like something that a major league player would get or Right now, and they've had it on for a while, Victus has a, if you get three plus bats, you get 50, 15% off. And if you get six plus bats, you get 20% off. So if you were to do this with like a group of friends like I did, um, and in Canada it came out to be a good price, is 150 Canadian, and we didn't get charged for duty. That's cheaper than any Marucci, and Marucci's, in my opinion, aren't that good, especially if you're paying 170 plus tax for them in Canada. That has been my little overview of the uh, two pickups I got. So if you like this video, please go give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. We just hit 600 subscribers. So thank you guys for that. And um, please comment any new videos ideas. There will be a What's in My Baseball Bag for 2017 coming out very soon. And uh, yeah, but before I go, just like to give a little shout out to Ace Acres. His description his link will be in the description and i'll put his channel on the screen right now he gave me a little shout out so i thought i would do the same but uh yeah so go check him out go subscribe and let me know if you do uh please put that in the comments but uh other than that guys thanks for watching and i'll see you next time bye i know something only i know i got superpowers but that's something only i know what i want is